Good morning from Peachtree. Well, not the city, from the actual peach trees. Okay, so Stan finished picking the little July Alberta yesterday. Uh, kind of smaller peaches, but the, the second crop was nice, a lot nicer than the ones that I made jam with. But now these, the delicious tree, he even said there was a little branch that broke yesterday. He said there's going to be 10 times as many peaches on this. So, <laughs> and they're huge. They're really, they're beautiful. They are absolutely beautiful. And there's more inside here. And, yeah, the inside ones aren't as ripe. And then the other tree after that. <laughs> I don't want to knock down these boards. Oh, yeah, that's way behind, thankfully. These are the contenders, which are actually my favorite to can normally, because they're not quite as big. Quick peek at the garden, and then we will be done for the morning. Uh, looks like we had a cat sitting on here. This is where we put the peaches, the peaches that we picked yesterday. Again, not quite as pretty as the other ones. Hey, did I just say last week that soon we won't be able to see the houses, the buildings on the other side? You can't see them. The field corn is that tall. And these cucumber plants look like they were dead last night. Oh, I guess they got revived. Stan found the hornworm that was down on, I don't remember which one, fourth from the end maybe, of the tomatoes. A little bit more tomatoes to pick here. There are a lot of, there's the peppers, a lot of paste tomatoes to pick. They keep, for, oh, he picked some yesterday. Let's go look at that. And a lot of um, peppers. <laughs> look at these. Okay, where's the ones he picked? Oh, goodness, this is crazy. We planted too much. We will be giving away to family again this year. Those are kind of small. Oh, and these. This is ridiculous. But they are really good. Brother-in-law said, well, those, those pink grape tomatoes are really good. And they are really good. We had some this morning um, in, in an omelet uh, in scrambled eggs with fresh basil, fresh parsley. Yeah, really good. And I noticed, yeah, there's our jumbo. Jumbo jalapenos. I noticed some pods. Yeah, they're not filled out yet, but you can see that these Ford Hook 242 Limas, they have grown a bunch and they're flowering like crazy. These Eva, or Ava, potatoes, <laughs> that's crazy. They have some new growth on them. So Stan has not dug these up yet. That is nuts. Plants are dying and they have new growth. I am tired of picking beans. I picked more yesterday. We had some sweet corn. I think we're going to pick some more just a little bit today, and then, I don't know, when we're going to do the rest of it. Probably in a couple of days. Um, it wasn't that sweet. And sometimes the first years are not the best years. Okay, I think that'll do it for today. <laughs> oh, goldfinch! Oh, I don't know. Oh my goodness. I don't think I can get Yeah, that's why I have so many snowplowers. They have them for the goldfinches. This is why Stan does the corn checking instead of me. Some of the serendipity was definitely ready. We have sweet corn to do today.